Welcome back, South Africa. A big topic right now is media freedom. Today, we have uh, our expert, our political analyst from the UCD Center of African Studies, Mr. Chester Missing. Mr. Missing, where are you? Loiso, hi, I am in Limpopo, helping my favorite right-wing extremist, Julius Malema. He's giving up politics to farm cattle. Julius is dedicated to becoming the BEE version of Eugene de Blanche. We need to talk about uh, media freedom, Mr. Missing. Yeah, you can't debate levels of media freedom, Gola. It's like pedophilia. There are no levels of pedophilia. You're either a pedophile or you're not. H hang on, Mr. Missing. Take it easy. Loiso, the Mail and Guardian, is just heat magazine with politics. Whether Makmaraj took a bribe or Gareth Cliff has syphilis, it's all the same. It's stuff we need to know, though. Yes, Lois, exactly. But we get turned on by it. I sit there going, oh, yes, you took a bribe. Oh, oh, the toilet has no walls. Fakila had an affair. Oh, yes, give it to me, Mail and Guardian. Give it to me. Who's your daddy? Who's your daddy? Helen Zeller's your daddy. That's who? Because Helen Zeller is a sugar mommy and the media is Ashton Kutcher. What are you saying, Mr. Missing? Every time the ANC messes up, someone at Talk Radio 702 gets a freaking erection. Hey, Mr. Missing, calm down. Caller, the media are the only people I know who think it's right to break into your house to look for evidence that you are a thief. What are they going to do next? Organize an orgy at an AIDS conference. It's ridiculous. Hang on, Mr. Missing. That's the point. It shouldn't be illegal to find out the truth. The, the truth? The truth? What's the truth, Caller? When I see a spade, I say, look, there's a spade. When the ANC sees a spade, they say, there is no spade, and if you mention it again, you'll go to jail. And when the DA sees a spade, they say, yeah, it's a spade, but we think Jacob Zuma wants to have sex with it. And when the media sees the spade? They tell you that spades don't sell newspapers, corrupt black politicians do. Bastards. Whoa, 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 whoa. Are you saying you agree with the secrecy bill? We all went bonkers about Black Tuesday, Gola. We went freaking nuts. I thought Black Tuesday was ESCOM, doing a new type of load shedding. It's black, but only on Tuesdays. The ANC says they're making things more transparent. No wonder Fakile cheated on his wife. He thinks the way to be more transparent is to keep secrets. So you disagree with the secrecy bill? No, Gola, what I'm saying, if his seer bonga Twele was any more nuts, Cadbury's would sell him as a chocolate. Mr. Missing, you're going to get us sued. No, 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 no. You think Nelson Mandela said, Oh, never and never and never again shall it be that this beautiful country will again experience the oppression of one by another. What he actually said was, never, never again, unless Mark Maraj gets a bribe. Ha! In your face, guys! Uh, don't worry, Mr. Kole, we are sending him off to hard labor as, as a Christmas elf. Please, Mr. Missing, please, please, don't say such things. Please, man. Screw you! Screw you! Screw you, Gola! I, I, I don't know what to say.